Orange and Clear is doing some innovative things with water and trying to position the company and society for the future of water. And with me is the CEO, Riggs Eckleberry, to talk about what's going on. And, and Riggs, it was so interesting to see um, how hot water tech is. Uh, there's a new unicorn, um, basically a billion dollar valuation of a private company um, that is in this space. So tell me about that and um, just the whole industry in general, where it's at right now. Well, first of all, I'm so sorry that I'm not with you physically because, A, I love being with you, but also the amazing food in New York and hanging out <laughs> with Vince and the team. Uh, but uh, at least we'll get the news across. You're right that water tech is heating up. Um, and a, a huge, in fact, um, gradient, which was incubated at MIT, became a unicorn this week. It was the biggest deal on Crunchbase. And what's interesting is, is that they're not doing, they're, what they've chosen is to really focus on um, water-heavy industries, pharmaceutical, uh, chip companies, food and beverage. Uh, when you make beer, you know, you know, it takes seven or eight liters of water to make one liter of beer, for example, right? So they've really chosen to focus in on that. But in fact, so are we. We have um, uh, business in the same space. And I think everybody's realizing that they got to start treating the water so as to reuse it and um, reduce water usage overall. Uh, we've heard about these terrible droughts and so forth. Uh, Kansas right now, in fact, is going through such a drought that they're literally liquidating entire wheat fields uh, with, with Roundup because they don't think they can get the wheat. So we've got to do something about the water. And that's why Gradient became a unicorn this, this last week. Uh, what's also special is that we created something called Water on Demand, which is the only way that people, regular people, can invest in these this exciting new space. Because you and me, we can't invest in Gradient. Uh, you and me, we can't invest in Seven Seas. That's JP Morgan. I'm sorry, Morgan Stanley Infrastructure Partners. We can't invest in Cambrian, which is also VC. But you and I can invest in water on demand, kind of like the same way people invest in an oil well. So um, all people have to do is go to waterondemand.net, click on invest now, and then they'll be talking to somebody you know very, very well, which is Ken Berenger, the mm -hmm. co-creator of Water on Demand. Yeah. And let's talk about water uh, tech and how you have uh, acquired a tech system. Um, so explain that acquisition and how that is strategically important to the company. Well, it's an initial letter of intent, so it's non-binding. But what we've done is we've identified the fact that when when you um, build uh, something that's like a, imagine your municipal utility that deliver water and they take your dirty water and they bill you. And if you don't pay, then they cut you off and they have to meet certain standards. Well, imagine that all that scaled down to a business like a brewery, right? Well, you need to have the same functionality. We call it an operating system. And uh, many people call it an operating system that's perfectly um, good descriptor, but it needs to happen for the private businesses that have the same problem. Now, so we signed uh, uh, an initial letter of intent with a fine, fine uh, developer that has their own Fortune 500 customers. They've been around for almost 20 years. They're a great company, and we intend to let that business continue because it's not a bad business and then use their expertise to build this operating system. Uh, last week, um, well, actually, by the time this comes out, it'll be the week before last, we published a presentation, an updated presentation, in which we made forecasts for water on demand, including modular water systems. And um, I covered it in my last uh, CEO briefing. I strongly encourage interested people to join my big, my weekly CEO briefing. We're now up to 212. And basically, we've done it since Zoom started. Uh, and all the people have to do is go to oc.gold slash CEO. So oc.gold slash CEO. Or just go to originclear.com and we'll invite you there. Join me. We love to tell you the latest that's happening. Yeah. Well, that's a great um, idea for people that are thinking about investing in water and don't know the space and want to learn more about the company and make sure it's what they want to do. They can go and get it straight from you. What's going on? So... <laughs> Well, not only that, they can get it from new to the street from Jane King. That's right. So, yes. Well, I just, you know, provide the platform for you to tell your story. Always so interesting, Riggs, to, to hear about what Origin Clear is doing. Thank you for joining us. It's my great pleasure, Jane. I'll see you next month. Okay. See you then. Bye. Thank you.